God might come in later than we expect, but he is coming powerfully. Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. Do you sometimes feel it is delayed for the promises of God, that those who do not ask for God still have a happy and good life, while the righteous and the believer might suffer longer and longer, and there seems to be no end to this state. In the book of Habakkuk, chapter 2, verse 3, God is talking to the prophet, put the vision in writing, because it is not yet time for it to come true, but the time is coming quickly, and what I show you will come true. It may seem slow in coming, but wait for it. It will certainly take place, and it will not be delayed. And this is the message, those who are evil will not survive, but those who are righteous will live, because they are faithful to God. It might seem not fair that God lets the righteous wait so long, those who believe in him, those who try to follow his commandments, those who put their trust in him and repent and are honest, while the people of this world still enjoy their lustful pleasures. But we need to understand that God delays the final day out of grace and it is to our benefit so that our faith may grow and become bigger and that finally he can bless us even more richly because that is his style to come in slowly but he's coming for sure and The punishment may come in slowly, but the punishment will be immense. And he's giving us time to recognize ourselves, to recognize our own wrongdoing to all people. All people have the chance to repent and to come back to the Lord. He does not want to punish. He wants to save everybody, so he's giving more and more time. That is why... The chosen ones of the Lord still need to suffer a lot from the wicked and need to be patient. God does not punish quickly, but it will endure and we need to be patient. The wickedness of the evildoers takes a long time, but God is coming at the right time and to each and everybody he will reward according to each and everybody's faith. Lord, we are sorry where we are impatient and we are sorry where we do not do what you request us to do. Help us to put our faith in you and to become just like you, to become righteous and do what you ask us to do. Forgive all that we do wrong and thank you for your patience. Thank you that you have won the victory over all evil. Thank you that you still give the time to repent, to come back to you. That, thank you that you do not want to punish us, but rather you want to save everybody. Help us and help all to understand that and to grow in faith, to come back to you and to walk on the path towards your eternal kingdom not away from it, but towards your kingdom, where we praise you forever. Amen.